Hey everybody, what is going on? It's your boy, Zo33, welcoming you back to another episode of Pokemon Snap. Last time, we went to the beach. Thanks. And this time, we're going to the desert. Because why not? This is going to be fun in the sands in the day. Obviously, when it specifies day or night, you probably can tell that there's obviously more than one day in the game that you basically going to be able to play with. So this is the day of the sands, and we've already got a Skoropi. Sand, sand, and more sand. A few berries away. We are gonna just release it from. Oh wait, there's a Pokemon over there, maybe. There's a Mandibus. Can you yeet a couple of apples over there, over that ledge? And where's the Scorpi? Eh, there we go. Make it come out the hole, and we'll turn our camera this way towards the Heplotile. Helioisk. I get that four mixed up. Awesome. Go, we'll get that picture as there's a Cagnia rolling around doing Cagnia things. We'll turn our camera quickly this way. And there's a Scropey in the air. Doing Scropey things. And this side, Mandy Buzz flying around. There's obviously a Crystal Bloom there we can take a picture of. And yeah, you're now running, aren't you, baby girl? We can't do much with this just yet. But there's three crystal blooms in this location, perhaps that has something to do with it. Who knows? Anyway, we're gonna keep going over the ledge here, and yeah, we got all the Pokemon that we can get right now in this area. Big monster guy walking around, always cool. Time to go over the sand dune. And what do we see is there's a Mandibus just flying above us, nice. I'll not take a picture of that, but hit Powdon's ass. The big ass. We'll get a picture of Cagnia. And we're coming close to the uh, edge. Give this Torchic some food. Oh. I'll throw this at you. Oh, really? Throw this over here at you. There you go, that's proof of it using the flame breath. Now watch this. Get a nice picture of Cagnia. Scan. Sends it rolling. And sends it rolling. As it piled on train keeps running away. We'll throw it an apple. And maybe it'll eat it. Who knows? Just eats it all in one go, of course. There's a Lycan Rock midday form over there we need to get a couple of pictures of. And this guy over here is a lazy bugger. As we can get a nice picture of it. Anyway, we'll give a quick scan. And reveal that there's a... Have some Pokemon in there. Anywho, we'll come down here. Vivillion's flying around. And a very quick speedy boy running as well. We'll also throw a couple of apples into the hole. Oh, wait, you come out. There's also some Trapinch down the hole. What's over here? Something's buried here in the sand. Oh yeah, there's the Cagnias rolling the sand bales, also you. We'll get the pincer out of the hole. That's always a nice picture, and then we'll get a good picture of Vivillion. Just soaring around. Anywho, we'll get this place over and done with. And that's for our first visit here in the desert. It was pretty good, not gonna lie. 
I enjoyed that little run around, we should say. And welcome back. Photos from brand new cars. I can't wait to see them. There we go. I'm back into the voice. I've had a break since last time. Got myself a coffee. It's gotten dark. And let's have a, some analysis of some Pokemon. Scroopy in the desert. In the desert. In the sandstorm. Get that picture. It's a four star, baby. Heliosque. Two star. We'll take that. We got... Eh, that's an alright picture of Mandy Bells. We do have the four star... Golden Boy, though, will get that in the frame for the Cagnia, and then the three-star baby. That That's just good. I like that one. <laughs> just a... Ah, I'm alive! <laughs> uh, we'll take a two-star here, piled on ass. Oh, that's pretty cool. Uh, that one's probably the best frame one. But the one of it eating is good. Because it adds an action in. We do have the three star Torchic of it incinerating an apple. We'll take that and the Lycan Rock. We didn't get a good picture of you. That's for a better time. Trap Inch, however, we got a decent picture of. Uh, the Villion. We'll take. That one's alright. That one's alright. It's one of the latter ones. I'd say this one. Because it's showing more of its wing and Crystal Bloom we can't show because we haven't got the uh, glow on them yet. Now, then. now let's see what we got. Scroopy new. Brand new. Add it to the photo decks. And boom. It's not the best picture, but it's still a good picture. Heliosk. Add it to the. Star category, gold star. Ooh, we we got a good picture. Mandy Bros, this is probably not the best. Yeah, bronze star. The Cagney is four star. We got two four stars in this room. That's actually pretty good. Granted, they're both bronzes, but it's still good pictures. We'll take that picture, add it to our collection, and hit Powder. Great timing. We got the big boy platinum diamond whatever you call it stuff. <laughs> and it's time to burn shit up. Nice Torchic, add it to the collection. There we go. Lycan Rock just discovery. above that hill. Nice Lycan Rock doing stuff and things in that. Trap inch. A new discovery. Trap nice inch. Work. And there we go. Bronze. We've got quite a few bronze stars. Is this better? It is. We got a better Vivillion. That's good. Let's hope we can get some other Vivillion pitches. 30k points needed to level up. Do we level up? Yeah. Pretty easily. Two star right. research level. Oh, we barely actually leveled up. We get our research titles and stickers. Ah. By the way, thanks to your progress you've made in your research, I've got something to report. I'll fill you in once the photos are squared away. I think you'll be pleased to hit us. Okie dokie, Professor Reno. Let's go to camp and see what we've got. Hopefully it's, uh... I don't know. Maybe a new route that we can tackle in the next episode? I mean, we're always wanting new things to explore. Now Let's then. see what he has to say. Looks like you've gotten some great research done in the desert. I suppose it's time to take the next step. Have you go there at night? With the photographs of the Illumina phenomenon in action, I can make Illuminorals for that island. Ooh, so that basically tells you we need to go at night and get the Illumina orbs. Something we will be tackling in the next episode. So, if you enjoyed this part, 
Leave a like down below. Subscribe if you want to. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.